which autoresponder is better get response or mailchimp so hey guys what's up rj here and today we are simply talking about which of the autoresponder is good one we will be talking about the pros and cons for both of the autoresponder that we have right now in this video get response and mailchimp be sure to watch this video till the end i have a very cool bonus for you as well in regarding to email marketing so stay tuned so for the if you don't know about what the autoresponder is used for so we generally use autoresponders to capture email and then we put them into our email list like let's say if this is a funnel if you don't know what a funnel link a funnel is i have put the link in the description down below we have free 4 day training if we are capturing the name and the email address over here what generally happens is that we are capturing the, their email and their first name put them into our list and then the autoresponder whatever we have set up the autoresponder automatic emails start to roll in that's how autoresponder generally work first thing uh, we talk about is the pros uh, for both of the autoresponders get response and mailchimp and let's we start with mailchimp so if we talk about mailchimp the first thing that we talk about is mailchimp is totally free okay if you are somehow starting out in your marketing business and inter marketing space and you simply don't want to pay for the autoresponder then uh, mailchimp is free for you okay you don't need to pay anything and mailchimp is also easy to use easy to integrate uh, when it comes with any other platform like shopify or clickfunnels it's very easy to use when it comes to a get response for that part get response cost you $15 a month for uh, let's say 1000 subscribers so you can simply use get response for $15 a month when it comes to the payment plans that they have so get response is generally not free and mailchimp is free other than this the a core difference between mailchimp and get response is that that mailchimp certainly don't allow you to promote affiliate offers like they don't allow and they simply don't like affiliate offers to be promoted so if you are certainly like an affiliate marketer and you are and you supposed to promote affiliate offers let's say any affiliate program then you are not supposed to use mailchimp because the thing is that they will simply ban you and they will close your account and their, your list will be gone so that's how mailchimp works but if you are uh an affiliate marketer and you are wanted to promote affiliate offers then get response is your way to go it's totally affiliate marketing friendly you can simply post on direct affiliate links and do whatever the email sequence that you simply want to have and how it works for you you can simply promote any affiliate offer that you simply want so affiliate uh, promotion using uh, get response is totally allowed and valid while mailchimp don't allow you to promote affiliate offers at all so that's the key difference between these two the third difference what happen is if you are using mailchimp and uh, if we are using autoresponders the main motive is that you will end up in the inbox tab this is the primary tab over here so the main motive for using an autoresponder is that that we should get end up over here in the primary tab not in promotion and definitely not in spam okay these two things we don't want to end up in and the problem with mailchimp generally is mailchimp uh, if we are using mailchimp then we uh, either we end up in the promotions or we simply end up in the spam that we everyone who is an email marketer hates we simply don't want to end up in spams and promotions folder so where get response simply allows you to simply get yourself directly into the primary box where they, we can simply hit our customers with our offers with our value posts whatever it will be and we can simply hit up in their straight away primary box rather than getting into the promotion and spam this this is one of the most important features when it comes to email marketing platform because there are also may other different email marketing softwares like active campaign aweber i will make uh, those videos which of them are better as well the differentiation between each and every autoresponder in the market right now we'll create a video for it as well but the core focus for email marketing is that your emails get into the primary box rather than promotions and spam folders okay so using if you're using get response then you're not going to be ending up at spam plus you're not going to be ending up in promotions because if you're using get response 
and you're writing emails you will get to know about what your spam score is and how many chances you have to end up in the spam folder or in the promotion side so it's one of the core important features so if we come on the result part if you are a marketer and you want to leverage everything that you're supposed to have in order to get your email marketing done in a correct way your way go is for a get response okay because you're not allowed to use affiliate products when it comes to mailchimp but get response allows you to do so the only thing is that mailchimp is free but get response is paid for at least 15 dollars a month that's it for at least thousand subscribers now there is a link in the description down below for mailchimp and get response if you sign up for any of them simply hit me up on my facebook profile or on my email and i will send you the free email sequence high converting email sequence which can simply you can use to leverage everything else like you have said you can simply set that up in your autoresponder and everything else and everything will be automated you can simply post your affiliate link so that those will be high uh, soap opera sequence or a sample sequence through which you can simply get yourself the sales out of it i've used it made sales out of it so you will get it for free just sign up the link is in the description below and until then see you next time